Hello and welcome to my garden and the dinosaurs who live there. It's Sunday the 22nd of January. Bit grey, bit breezy, but still not too cold actually, so that's great. Um, and today, at last, I'm going to sow my first seeds of the year. Okay, I've chosen um, a few seeds that I'm going to sow at this point. Um, and the first one is P. Kelvin and Wonder. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to sow in all the seeds I'm, I'm putting in today are going to go in pots. Um, some are going to go into the house onto a window ledge and most are going to go into a, a, a sort of plastic grow house to sort of take their time to, to um, sprout and grow on. So, first of all, I'll do these peas. This is ordinary potting compost and vermiculite mixed in, which is my preferred way of doing things. Um, and I'm just going to use these little pots. So there's my pot. And I'm going to put three peas in here. So just make some holes. Take my holes off. A bit cold and breezy today. These are from last year but hopefully they'll be okay. One, two, three. A little bit more compost and that's it. So I'm going to do um, probably about eight pots worth and I will come back after I've done that and go on to the next thing. Okay, I've got some sweet peas now to put in. So I've put in the peas, I'm now going to sow some sweet peas. Um, I've got Hilda's mix here, which was given to me by Alan at uh, the Don Chorus plot. And I grew some of these last year and I had some seeds left. Uh, <clears throat> I've got these, which are blue sweet pea mix. Uh, just a few of those left. And I've got two packets there, so I'll probably just use one. This is a, a Sweet Pea Royal mix. There's 25 seeds in there. So I'm going to get all of these sown just in the, exactly the same way as I sowed the, the peas. I'm going to put them into pots. Um, just a quick word on the why I use the, the mix that I do. Um, if I had seed sowing mix, I'd probably use seed sowing mix and the vermiculite in, but um, I don't have, so I've just got ordinary um, potting compost. But I put the vermiculite in because um, it adds a bit of lightness to the, to the compost mix. It lets the air get into the roots of the seedlings as they're growing and it helps drainage. So it's, you know, I, I always use vermiculite um, and quite often actually, particularly when I'm sowing slightly smaller seeds, I'll top the pot off with vermiculite as well rather than putting sipped compost for example on top. So that's why I'm using this. So again, I'm going to fill some pots up. I'll probably need to go and get some more pots. I'm going to put three sweet peas into each of these little pots and um, then they will go in along with the peas into the plastic grow house and just take their time to germinate and grow into hopefully small little plants, little sturdy plants, um, maybe come April time, uh, maybe May, I can get them out into the ground. Right, I've got two varieties of lettuce that I'm going to sow today. I've got Marvel of Four Seasons and I've got Red Salad Bowl. And I'm going to use half of a half tray each, so a quarter tray each, I guess. And I'm going to put these on the windowsill um, in the house. Um, I've got a little uh, propagator lid for it as well. So hopefully they will germinate in time and start growing on and I can get an early crop of lettuce for me and the chickens and the quail. So, um, Marvel of Four Seasons. It's a bit breezy today, it's not ideal for sowing seeds outdoors, but get these in before hopefully everything gets even more windy. 
Sunday. So I'm just going to do a light, uh, a light sprinkling, broadcasting on the soil. And then I will put some vermiculite over the top, since these are small seeds. But I'll put the other ones in first. So that's Marvel of Four Seasons. And this is red salad bowl. Crazy weather. Now it is quite early, but we'll see how we go. And lettuce, the other seeds in my hand. Lettuce are cold weather crops, so it's not that I'm going to be um, trying to germinate them outside right now. So hopefully they'll be all right. That's the plan anyway. What I'll do is just give them a light watering and as I say pop them in the window the windowsill in the house so they'll be like that all nice and cozy I'll shut the vent initially then open it as soon as they start to germinate So that's me then, got my first sewing done of the year, yippee! Um, so peas, Kelvin and Wonder, they're now in the, the, the grow house there. Uh, three different varieties of sweet pea, they're also in the grow house there. And then the two varieties of lettuce that are coming into the house with me. Okay, so that's me got some lettuce, some peas and some sweet peas in. And uh, we'll see how they got, they got on. I'll keep you posted but for now um, I'll call a halt uh, if you've enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribed I'd love for you to subscribe to follow me in my gardening chicken keeping quail keeping and beekeeping journeys but for now bye